not just making money making impact not just making income the struggle to make a mark not the struggle to make a name the struggle to know not just the struggle to be known the struggle to point to you to the person up i remember at the beginning of our ministry we had met with our father in the lord and started relationship before the ministry started but at the beginning of the ministry he was in lagos and we are here and bishop abue was in kaduna so we decided let's get close to him and whatever will connect from our father we can it can flow through him as well and i got close to him and he said no our father is in lagos we can reach him and he put a call through he pointed me from himself to our father in the lord and i will never forget that for life finally it's a man who has done very very tireless brutal labor and like mama has just said i want to say to you sir the best days are ahead there is never a wasted labor in the kingdom uh, there is one statement i enjoy so much from what dr paul and nature have said dr paul nature was seeing him as a father figure and even the word he mentioned was passing attribute as a father in ministry now dr paul nature even went further to even see that even when he met with bishop david that he was so surprised to see a man that would just follow a man of god the way he did and still be humble like this that this thing is something that he could not even believe or expect that any man of god could follow and still be humble as the man of god is humble that he only wish him farewell but he believed that it's not the end of the road for him in ministry there are some certain things he believe he can still achieve at this time of actor in his life but the most important thing is that even as he's going to go and rest that so many of his children and well wishers are still happy with him that even though they will miss him but they are still happy with him now the question here is that why the retirement i will still see it from my own view because this man is still capable this man is still able this man is still good this retirement is not something that's supposed to come at this time now but dr paul M. Nietzsche still went further to explain some certain things still went further to express his feelings towards the retirement and went further to mention that he just believed that this retirement will not keep him his back or the death but he believed that this retirement is for another freeze of life freeze of ministry and freeze of a different thing entirely to come forth and this thing was not just something that everyone was seeing but it was something that everyone were just happy to experience the change in everything now even when dr paul in nature was saying those things or he was saying uh bishop david bimo was feeling it inside his mind that when all the men of god have gathered just to hear one or two things that he want to see and he just came out to come and see a few things that even touch the heart of so many people but it was something of joy and decorum of seeing the man of god at that level in ministry feeling that he want to retire but God we still have it in place that he is so grateful to god that he was opportune to meet the retirement of bishop david Obiomo. that is something of great privilege to him to witness that is very very happy and it's not just happy but he's happy to experience this call of retirement from the man of god but he prayed that the good lord will continue to keep him from this day to another day and from this 
moment up to the moment of anything you want to do that god will be keeping him please if you're new to this channel please can you subscribe and like the video in our next video we will be dropping another different hot video again